Hey, hey, Spring Lafay, Simply Tarot. Look what I got. It came today. Mystical Shaman Oracle. They're beautiful. Here they are. So, I'm going to do a special message. See what we get with a special message. Special message. Got ink pen on my nail. I'll look over it. So, all my readings are timeless. Only take away what resonates, leave the rest behind. Please do give it a thumbs up. That way YouTube sees fit to move it along so that whomever needs to see it may see it. Special message. What kind of special message do we need today? Special message, please. Special message. What do we need to know today? We actually got three. Ooh. Happy home, happy life. Okay. What well, this is... Okay, yes. I'm going to clarify, but... I know what I'm feeling. Can we please clarify the death card? Can we please... Okay, yes. See, this is about the past. Someone has uh, basically put the past to rest. They have put this past to rest, and they are are they are starting a new cycle. So that's what I was getting. It's like someone is focusing on their family, their home, their life, and aiming for what they want. It's that type of feeling with that. Nine of Cups, the Wish card. Someone is aiming for what they want in their life. Whatever that wish means to you. That's beautiful. So we're going to put this here. It's like someone's had some form of um, ending. Something they've let go of. And it feels like, you know, for many it's within. For others it's letting go of people that no longer serve or situations but for many it's got to do with letting go of behaviors patterns things that yeah that's basically got to do with the past that's why that wanted to fall out can you tell us more please that is following intuition that is seeing clearly that is looking at things straightforward that is no rose colored glasses so to speak can you tell us more see it's happiness having happiness within your life and you know this doesn't have to be with someone um, this just feels like total happiness and some of you I know that I'm talking to are alone or are with your children um, without a partner some of you have a partner but some of you don't so this is this is like happiness within finding that place where you know you actually raise yourself up you know and put yourself first and know your worth and your value okay We've got the Page of Pentacles here, and we've got the King of Wands. Just got to clarify that King of Wands. Well, and the Page of Pentacles. Remove these. Can we please clarify the Page of Pentacles? The Page of Pentacles, please. Can you please clarify the Page of Pentacles for us? Ten of Cups. 
Can you please clarify the King of Wands? The King of Wands, the King of Wands. Can you please clarify the King of Wands? The King of Wands, the King of Wands. Okay, this is you. What this is, is you are balancing your life. You're balancing um, your family, your life, your home, your, your job, everything. You've got it balanced. You know, and this is the Ten of Cups. This is about love. Um, but I feel like, you know, for many of you, this is about love. Love. Not necessarily with some, like a life partner or such. Now, I feel like for some of you, yes, you have that life partner. Others of you, that's something I feel like you're waiting on. Can you please tell me more about the Ten of Cups? The Ten of Cups, please. Yeah, see, many of you don't have that. But, 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 you had this tower moment, and you got hurt. But you've moved to the Magician. So you're manifesting this Ten of Cups into your life. That's beautiful. Balance. Oh my goodness. This this is really, really beautiful. Okay. Can you tell us more? Can you tell us more? Do we need to know more, please? Do we need to know any more? Yeah, being the hermit. Working on yourself. You are currently working on your life, your family, your, your home, yourself. I feel like you're working, you know, spiritually as well. I'm going to take one and see what we get if they'll give us one can we have one please spirit I did clear these can we have one please spirit do we need one spirit do we need one there we go there it is it flipped flipped the sacrifice so <laughs> what I'm feeling with this is that you know you you may feel like you have sacrificed a lot in your life but it, it feels like you're 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 having gratitude for what you do have you know you may have thought when this tower moment came and you got stabbed hurt that you know that was like the end but you see, even though it feels like you have sacrificed a lot, you're seeing the beauty and you're seeing the growth. You are um, growing as a person. And that, that is helping you to see that you have so much to be grateful for. That's what I'm feeling with that. That's really beautiful. Okay, we're going to check and see if they'll give us one of these right quick. Can we have one of these, please, Spirit? Do we need one, Spirit? Do we need one, Spirit? One, Spirit? Can I have one? Can I have one? Can we see one, please? Yep, there it is. Warrior Woman. Have you answered your deepest calling? So, you may be looking right now at, within to trying to figure out what is your calling? What are you meant to do here? Um, you know, and... I feel like many of you are gifted as well and you you need to be um, meditating if you don't do we need one of these do we need one of these do we need one of these feels like you're working on your own spiritual growth and um, growth within as a person too that's going to move you forward a time for healing you're healing that's why we got the hermit here. Be bold and make the first move. Hmm. 
Well, interesting. You and your loved ones are safe. So if you've been worrying about your loved ones, I feel like this is Spirit's way of letting you know that your loved ones are safe. Be bold and make the first move. You know, I feel like this is in your life. This is within your life. Uh, there's something that you need to do that will help you overcome something that is holding you back is what I'm feeling. Okay, I put all the cards up and everything. This card, for some of you, this is not going to be all of you, but for some of you that are manifesting what you want, there's going to be something you're going to have to sacrifice. There's In some portion of your life, there's going to be some sort of sacrifice you will have to make. Um, whether that means moving, or whether that means um, changing jobs, or it's going to be different for different people, but I feel it strongly. Um, it came on me. And yes, for some of you, there will be something that you will have to sacrifice for what you want so badly. That's what I've got. Bye.